in a little bit of a twist, we are talking about our uh, uh, specialty knots list now, and we're using actual rope. Yeah, how about that? This is the heaving line, and it is a very, very simple knot, so there's not a whole heck of a lot to say about it. Now, this is what you might call a messenger. That is, if you need to toss a rope over something and you have no other materials, not even like a rock, then this is the knot that you would want to tie because it gets things comparatively dense. You can get that, to, it's got a bit of heft to it, so you can toss it out over a branch or so that it reaches somebody who's in the water, that kind of thing. Try not to hit people in the head though because then they'll sink and you'll have to dive after them. That would be unfortunate and kind of a lot of work on your part. <laughs> okay. Um, if you did have a stone or something though, you would want to put that in the middle of a monkey's fist, which is, there are hundreds of... <laughs> there's probably actually hundreds of uh, direct... Yeah. instructional videos for that on YouTube, so I'm not going to cover that right now. Um, probably at some point in the future, see, comp uh, see description and dare if they keep the annotation system around. I heard they're switching, to, trying to switch to something else. Anyway, you start with, an, with a sizable length to spare, and that'll take some getting used to. And just a simple little eye. It doesn't matter which direction you're going, just start going in that direction and spiral around and just keep going in that direction. The more line you have at the start, the bigger the heaving line knot is going to be. Like that right there is actually a little bit short. I'm going to try this again. There we go. Okay. Okay, so there's a nice tall one. You notice the geometry is overall based on something not entirely unlike a noose, just with no loop on it. Uh, noose is in hangman's noose. And uh, that is, is pretty hefty right there. It's got some decent weight to it. I would not advise using it as a weapon though, because um, that, would, that, that could hurt people. You should you should definitely not do that. <laughs> uh, although seriously, I don't think it's going to, unless you're really swinging this thing. I don't think it's really going to hurt that much. Like, it's it's hardly. Well, we'll we'll talk more about that when we get to the when we get to the monkey's fist. But uh, yeah, that's that's been more than long enough. All right. Uh. Give me a like to raise my ranking in search results. Give me a subscription to watch more of my videos in the future. Maybe consider visiting the comments and seeing another link or two of uh, other knots or maybe a gear review, uh, if that's your kind of thing. Um, share this video around, though, because I could really use the, the extra press. Um, more viewers is always better for me. Um, and this is the kind of thing that uh, you might want people to know. All right. Thanks.